my name is Eileen Kelly, and I am Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen 2012, and you're watching Pageant Professors. I actually started three years ago when I was a freshman in high school, and I got started because my mom used to do pageants, and she gained so much knowledge about style, service, scholarship, and success, and also the scholarship money she got for college was incredible. So I really was interested, and that's how I got started. sure that my life was based around style, service, scholarship, and success, the four points of the Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen Crown. And as long as my life was based around those four points, I think the judges would realize that I was ready for the role. My reign has been so much fun. My platform is Go Wild, celebrating our national forest, which is right in New Hampshire, saying it was the first national forest. Uh, and it's been so much fun. I've been able to go to schools, make hiking paths behind elementary schools, and also I've learned so much about myself, about how I'm, I've never been interested in public speaking until I got started as Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen, and I'm actually in two public speaking courses, and I might be going into broadcast journalism when I get out of high school. Um, and when it comes to preparing for nationals, it's 138 days away. I have it counted down on my wall. Uh, it's more of just working on my interviews and practicing my talent, which I love. I'm, sing I'm a singer, so I'm practicing my vocal talent. I was singing um, Part of Your World, a Miley Cyrus a Miley Cyrus version of Part of Your World. And it was so much fun. I rocked my Tony Bowles short dress, and it was really fun. My evening gown I got um, at Regalia Magnificent Apparel in Florida. And when I went to go see Lauren, who is the Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen 2011, in Orlando compete at Miss America's Outstanding Teen, I was down in Florida, and I got to go to my Regalia and get my beautiful pink ball gown. Yes, uh, me and her are best friends, so we talk. She's actually with me here tonight, but we go to events together and she's always there for support. She gives me long talks in the car about what it's like to be Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen and what to expect. My interview is my favorite part of competition. Um, I totally myself and I get to talk with people. I love me making friends, so that's, I get to I te uh, act as if each judge is a new person I'm meeting and making them my friend. And what I wore, I wore a short cocktail dress that was made at um, Brad Lowe in Concord, which is a local designer, and he's, been no he's phenomenal. Uh, Miss Merrick Sustain Teen is about scholarship. I have gained so much scholarship money just by this wearing this crown and acting the part of Miss New Hampshire's Outstanding Teen. And also, it involves the talent portion, which I'm very strong, I love performing and I love singing, so that's mainly why I chose this, plot, uh, this organization. <clears throat> I can't decide between my earrings or shoes. I'm thinking earrings because they complete an outfit in my opinion. <laughs> I love jewelry. <laughs> Everybody thinks it's so weird, I feel bad showing it, but I can bend my ear inside. Like, I don't know if you can see. <laughs> um, any pageant girl knows what I'm talking about when you have your rollers plugged into an adapter plugged into your car. It's so much fun. I mean, it's really fun. Like, I, I find pleasure in the fact that I can do this um, in the car, but I just rolled my hair and then clipped it back using mirror on my car, um, fold down mirror. Did you know that there are some really common mistakes that girls make during the evening gown portion of their competition? Click on the link in the description below and you'll be taken to our website for a free 30 minute long training course. By the end of it, you'll learn how to avoid these common mistakes and master the evening gown portion of your competition today.